clerical things, McGarry, Mayfield, yeah. um, Darren Hall. Yeah, a couple things. Uh, McGarry, sick, nothing serious. Mayfield, obviously, he's been sick the last couple of days. Uh, still got it, you know, his back, so he's working through a couple of things. Uh, Darren, um, just recovering, nothing major, and then he'll be gone the rest of the week um, on a personal matter. But um, he'll be back after that. Patterson, he's on his ramp up recovery plan that we planned out the whole time. We'll see him back here a week from the day, ready to roll. Uh, what about Drake London? I mean, we haven't seen him in a couple of weeks. Is he still We've on? seen him every day. We haven't. That's great. We're well, only out here for 30 minutes, too, so. Starting today. Uh, is he is he still on track for for week one? Is that because you'd said you had said a couple weeks ago that everybody would I feel hope good about where he's at. I'm not gonna make a prediction, but I feel good about where he's at. <laughs> that good? That's better. That's right. better. You know, this is your second time through it now as a head coach. How sure. do you, what did you learn maybe from last year and how you did it? And how you handled cuts that maybe you do differently or, or didn't do differently? Well, you know, it was a little bit different. Um, like I said, we talked talked a little bit about this Saturday night. There's a lot of different. It's going to be very fluid. So what you may see tomorrow, four may look different. Wednesday at four may look different. Thursday or Friday. Uh, you know, without the preseason four, these transactions happen happen earlier now. Uh, last year you were still dealing with some of the COVID restrictions, so that was a different dynamic. Uh, we also played Sunday night, so we didn't practice that Monday. And you know we only you know, we only get a certain number of practices this week, so we end up practicing that, that Tuesday. So it's a little bit different. We practice today. We will not practice tomorrow. We'll be back out here Wednesday and Thursday. So there are a lot of things that are a little bit different. The variables have changed, but like anything, you, you know, you look what we did in the past and what can we improve on. We've certainly done that. And in terms of Bernhardt, you know, what mm -hmm. he's done this camp, what, how, how has he impressed you? I guess this camp with what he's been able to do because he came in not really knowing the receiver position all that much either. Well, like a lot of guys. I mean, we got guys playing different positions. You know, Avery, Felipe, um, a lot of guys. You know, have done a good job. He's come out here every day and worked. And, um, we'll see what happens. Uh, how, how do you, um, or, or timetable-wise, how much time do you have to declare a center starter? I have till uh, 1 o'clock on right after 11. So, are you closer? That, to you asked my timetable. <laughs> yeah. Are we closer? Yes, yeah, yes. Closer but you, that. I was just answering your question literally. Right. No, we are closer, D-Lab. Not yet. Okay. What, what do you need to? Is did you? What do you need to see to make that decision? At this point? Well, okay, a little bit. I want to step back because the competition has been so competitive, and I don't. I told um, both the guys, they they've handled it really well. It's not an easy thing to do. Uh, the spirit of cooperation on a really competitive. Uh, job opening, and then both those guys, you give them a lot of credit. I, uh, you know, I want to take a step back, go back through everything, so we can, you know, take emotion out of it and make a good, good objective decision. You messed around with uh, rotating centers at one point last year. Are, is mm -hmm. that something you would do, or is, or do you want? I mean, everything's on the table. Out. I mean, that's yeah. not the plan, but if we thought that was the best thing for this team, we'll do it. But doesn't mean we're gonna necessarily. That's our plan. I'm not doing the. Uh, uh, what is it? You're playing both platoon and the quarterbacks? Yeah. No, we're not looking to do that at center right now. So. With, the, with that, I think the last time we talked to you about that, you made the comment about like the difference is going to be being able to see the command of the offense mm -hmm. through those two guys. In what ways have you seen them grow? In, in yeah, both of them have. Both of them have. Impress them. Just like impressing the quarterbacks. <laughs> Don't want to make it easy on them. Make it easy on them today and you try to rationalize things and it doesn't help them get ready to play on Sunday. What, what is the approach to practice this week? Is there been you know, a lot of competition all preseason? You're kind of gearing up the preseason games. How do you take this week, obviously, without a, without a game? Same thing. I mean, continue every time we got an opportunity to come out here. They're really good teams. They improve as the season goes on. They're really good teams I've been around. If you look historically, if you want to be trending in this direction you know, towards the end of the year. That's our objective every time we step on field. When it comes to process like of the front office looking at other cuts made with other 53 man across the league and how they bring that to you guys and, and y'all make that decision in terms of guys you maybe want to bring in. Yeah, I mean, they're constantly looking at that. I think, you know, you have 32 teams that are monitoring the waiver wire. 
Uh, everybody's got different philosophies. You, you see some guys that were uh, released over the weekend, some guys today, it leaks out. You know, they tell somebody today, their agent may leak it to you guys, or a player may tell people. Uh, everybody's got different processes, but <clears throat> everybody will, all 30 team, 32 teams will monitor the waiver wire. How much do you watch much film of other guys, of other teams at that point, just to look at guys too, or do you? If it's something that we think is serious, yeah, I'll, I want to take a peek at them, okay. know who potentially we may bring in here. Oh, I meant in the pre. I meant like the pre-process. Absolutely. Like, you do okay. Yeah. Is there a certain position that you and Terry might be fine? Any any position we think is going to help us, we'll we'll look at.